You dudes, what's going on? I wasn't gonna film a vlog today um, because I'm like three behind right now on editing. But I wanted to say hello and I wanted to complain. Just a little bit. Mike Peralta, semi daily vlogs. Music Mike vlogs. Okay. So yeah, um, today's Thursday. I don't know when you're actually gonna see this because I'm behind. I got like two more, uh, two or three, no, I have like two videos to edit and also a show video that was from freaking December to edit and upload. And also, did you guys know this, by the time this video comes out, you'll probably already know, right? Like when I'm releasing my music video on Sunday. Today's Thursday before the 20th, January 20th. So yeah, um, I hope the release went well and I didn't F it up somehow. But uh, anyway, um, it's Thursday and I took a last minute uh, fill-in spot for somebody else. I was supposed to play here. Uh, I'm, at, I'm in Riverside. I'm playing my Riverside gig where they rope off the, <laughs> the street and stuff so that people can't drive through and they get really pissed off. And they're like, it's all because of the singer. I'm going to go boo him. But uh, uh, I'm supposed to play tomorrow. And I decided to play tonight too because they needed me. They didn't have anybody else to fill in. So that was awesome. Uh, the people who just walked past me told me that I should play again soon because I sounded good. Yay. So I'm not having a really shitty night. Because um, <laughs> sometimes I have really shitty nights, let's, let's face it. I'm starting to realize too, besides the fact that I go too fast and get out of control tempo and uh, uh, out of control volume on the vocals, out of control volume on the vocals makes me pitchy and uh, sometimes can kill the rhythm because I stop hearing the rhythm and I just hear my vocals. And uh, out of control uh, guitar, like too loud, you know, kind of makes it sound clangy and cheap and stuff and um, kills the tempo. So I always try to like control my volume and my tempo. I try to like, you know, play light and easy. It's kind of hard when you get excited. You want to be like, dah, 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 dah. I'm still struggling with that. But anyways, I just remembered again tonight. I should have already known this for so long, but uh, when you play the guitar too loud, it kills your bass frequencies. And a lot of the times I'm playing like by myself, I'm thinking like, my freaking guitar sucks, man. I wish I had a bassist. Because it's all thin, you know? And I just realized like, because right now I was playing like really soft and slow. By the way, I didn't have enough time to set up all my stuff. So this is not going to be recorded and uploaded. Not like I'm already not like 14,000 videos behind on the live channel. but. Um, traffic was a bitch it was like seriously two hours and I still was like five minutes late to start up and I had to sacrifice setting up my table there's no camera there's no audio recorder nothing I'm just playing for nothing <laughs> it's fun though I'm, I'm getting a little cash so some people kept walking up behind me it was awesome they uh I didn't even set up my tip jar or anything because I didn't have enough time actually that is the tip jar why is it focus focus on my hand everyone focus on my hand god it looks gross right now okay so can you see this fuzzy spot right here? Yeah, that's my tip jar, but uh, that's for to buy stuff. And uh, they all thought that that was my tip jar. So even though I hadn't set anything up, these people kept running up behind me and throwing money in there. And then I had to go throw all the money in there after they were gone. It was very nice. Cause you know, usually you like set up a tip thing, like please tip me. Then you're not sure if they're just doing it out of kindness <laughs> or what. But when they run up to you, like holding a dollar up to you while you're trying to play, that's kind of cool. So uh, I did a sort of a good job of like, you know, controlling my volume on the guitar and all of a sudden the guitar sounded bassy. So remember this guys, if you play guitar, just remember that the harder you hit the strings, the less bass you have on that guitar. I don't even know why. Because technically, I don't know. I mean, I took like a couple, a couple of physics classes and yeah, I don't know. I don't really know why. Maybe it's because, I don't know, that's because, I don't know. Anyway, so I'm just hanging out here. Security keeps popping on every once in a while. They're hanging out. They're kind of like talking next to a thing right now. They, they watch out for me. Very cool. I used to play another mall, which I loved, and I loved the bookers, both of them. But um, the security would refuse to watch my stuff while I went to the bathroom. So I'd be like, okay, I'll just hold it for like four hours. That's cool. Even though I had to go when I got here. Bitches. So I don't know what else to tell you guys. I'm having fun. People kind of sort of, they'll show up in a group and then they'll get cold and then they'll go inside and eat and then they'll come back out and then they'll leave. So 
right now we're going through a little bit of a dead phase with like there's like two groups of people listening right now seriously that's it but anyway i'll talk to you at a later date and time okay we're done uh the gig is over this was seriously the loneliest gig ever it wasn't even quite as cold as the other time which was also lonely but there were a lot more people but seriously um the last 45 minutes i played to this I had people, and it was like it, it was like disheartening because usually, you know, it's either completely dead or there's people. But this time was like a lot of people, so I got my hopes up, and then it was dead. <laughs> so it was like a slap in the face. But anyway, I just took an Instagram photo. Did you guys see it? Loneliest gig ever. But at least they roped off the street for me, so people would not run me over. And I didn't even do my table because. Uh, well, I'm dumb, and I spent my time making a phone call to a friend on my break instead of putting up my table. <laughs> All right, you guys, I guess that's it for me. I'm just freezing. I've got to, because there's a fountain. Maybe that's part of why it's, it's cold right now. And also, it's January. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time, dudes. Psych. Uh, the vlog's not over. In fact, do you guys know any? What the hell? There's a freaking horse down there. You see that? Hold on, I'm going to zoom in. What is this? It's a freaking horse. It's like, happy anniversary, honey. Happy anniversary, honey. Please don't be mad at me for last year. It's kind of cool. It's a carriage. Anyway, um, you guys notice anything uh, different about me besides the fact that I've grown even balder and grayer than last time? I'm still wearing the same sweatshirt. That's a hint. <laughs> no, it's not a hint. Actually, it is a hint. This is the second day. I'm here. It's Friday. And I just wanted to say hi because I'm here again and like, you know, whatever. It's a little bit less dead this time. See, there's like people walking around and stuff like that. The uh, the bleachers were actually totally full when I started. I know that sounds bad, but it was like slowly getting em more and more emptier as the night went on. But uh, there were still people in there. And then as soon as I stopped playing just now, it totally cleared out. It were like, I don't know. There was like a table full of people right there. And then a guy who was like sleeping while listening. And uh, a couple other, I don't know. They just, I said, I'm going to go on break and they took off. So feeling pretty good I guess. Anyway, so I'm still here. I had time today to set up my table, but I don't think anybody bought anything. It was weird. No, nobody bought anything, which is weird because there was less people yesterday by far, and yet people yesterday were coming right up to me and just throwing money in my bucket, which was just like next to me because I didn't set it up. Today I have it all set up. Nobody's buying shit. Freaking, freaking Riverside, man. You guys are weird. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna start saying you guys are weird to every city that I can think of. What was the last one? Long Beach. Anyway, so I'm on break. I just want to say hello. Goodbye, security. Goodbye. Um, yeah, so it's not their fault. They're just doing their job. But uh, I wanted to go to the bathroom right now and I needed security to watch my stuff. So then there were seriously three security guys. There's like one guy right there, one guy right there, and one guy right there in his cart. And I progressively went towards each one of them as they completely walked away before I even got anywhere near them. So I was like walking, I was like walking down there and the guy like turned around and left. And I was like, God damn it. So then I turned around and I went over here to try to get that guy and he totally left. And then I tried to get the guy in the cart and then he totally drove away. So basically I have to hold it for the next hour of my set because I'm done, essentially. That's essentially the reason for everything that I do. Um, I'm kind of happy because I thought I was gonna get sick. I, I like took the extra day, you know, yesterday. I was subbing for yesterday, Thursday, and um, as soon as I agreed to it, I like ate a candy bar. I think actually I might have eaten like food poisoning. I might have gotten food poisoning by a bad power bar or something because I had like a power bar or not a power bar, like a like a Luna bar, and I started feeling all weird in my throat and like sick to my stomach, and I was like, God damn it! I just freaking signed up for two days. I thought I was going to be coughing for both of these gigs, like the whole gig. I've totally done that before too. Just showed up to a gig and they don't have anybody to replace me. I don't want to flake on them. So I just show up and I'm just like singing and then cough while I'm singing and then come back to the microphone. So yeah, I guess my break is almost going to be over now. I'm going to start playing again. I missed the Christmas tree. Do you guys remember the Christmas tree? Whoa, was my face out of focus? God damn it. I like to go out beyond the white breaker Where a man can still be free Or a woman if you are I like swimming in the sea My, 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 it's 
a beautiful world I like drinking Irish tea With a little bit of lapsex and shine I like making my own tea Driving in my car Sometimes I wish I could Lose you again You and me Everything you say
Across the bridge and down the lane I knew I loved you then You said you did the same Oh Maggie, what have you done? I should have seen it coming To your side I'd run
see from my face the diamonds flying high. And I don't think that I'm gonna see her again. But we shared a moment that will last till the end. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. Okay, so I'm done with my second set and more people showed up and uh, they're just I mean not a whole lot but you know like there's a few tables there was a freaking guy who uh hold on there was a freaking guy who like uh, stayed for the entire performance like from almost the first note that I played and then like every time I stopped he would sort of leave for a little while and I thought he was gone then he'd come back or a couple times he left to get like a sandwich or something I don't know but I was seriously because I know there are other people here but um he was seriously the guy who was there the whole entire time. He was just listening. He wasn't like hanging out with his friends, you know what I mean? Like he could have been warm in his in his bed right now. <laughs> and he chose to listen. So I was going to give him a free CD, like a full CD. The $10 CD. But he took off. As soon as I stopped playing, he just friggin' darted. So you guys, word of advice. If you're like the number one supporter of somebody at a show, don't expect anything, but stick around and say hello. They might give you something. I was seriously going to give that guy something right now. Oh well. Anyway, time to clean up. I guess I have people in benches sitting behind me too. Sort of listening. Sometimes the people in benches listen. Sometimes they're not listening. But I'm going to clean up now. Cut to the parking lot. I'm already packed up, ready to go home. Got my shit in there. I got my sweaters off. And uh, there are still sort of people in there. It's kind of a fun day. There were a lot of people who were there and they didn't give a shit if I was playing or not, but there were also a lot of people who seemed to very much enjoy it. There was like some girls, like she was like trying to like get somewhere and then she had to like have her mom with her. And her mom like stopped to listen to me. And then the girl got all annoyed with her, like, Mom, let's go. And then she was just like listening. And then her daughter was like all fed up with her, like, God oh, damn it, mom. I remember how that felt, by the way, so I feel your pain. But anyway. And uh, yeah, so I guess, oh man, I'm gonna be so far behind on uploads. Tomorrow I'm having the celebration dinner with Alex in the Orange Circle for our you know, music video that we just completed for the song I heard. By the time you even get this, dude, it's gonna be like released for like a week or two. Seriously, man, I gotta freaking, cause I'm trying to do on the clock more. I'm trying to like program to like earn day job money more. So it's harder to find time for shit it was hard to time to find. Uh, <laughs> it was hard to find time for shit before. Now it's getting worse. I think I'm delirious, as I usually am, when I just have a couple power bars and take off for Riverside. Well, you guys see how dumb I look in the reflection. <laughs> That's how I look, holding up my arm in the middle of the parking lot. I don't seem to care though. People walk past me, and I'm like, what, "What's going on?" And then he's like, "Dude," and I'm like, "Oh, sorry, sorry." <laughs> I was just doing my natural thing. Um, so, yeah, I, I thank you for watching. And uh, I, I love you guys. <laughs> TTYL. Don't get diarrhea. Subscribe, comment, and share, and stuff. Take your child away